Okay, so here we go. Night sky. I stared wide-eyed at the inky blue night sky. The Boston skyline sitting in the horizon was reflecting off of the slow rolling waves. I sat perched atop a vacated lifeguard chair amidst an equally deserted beach. The wind whipped, pasting loose strands of my pulled back hair to my face. The dry gusts cleared every drop of moisture from my eyes. I could not, and I did not blink. The stars peered out cautiously from behind the scattered clouds. Ever so slowly, each one revealed himself, themselves, like a shy child stepping out of their mother's protective shadow, or similar to someone who has yet to be really seen, but who wants to be. I felt frozen in awe at each tiny spark that emerged. They appeared to be, by their timid approach, fearful of this world they shied down upon daily and nightly. They see every race and every identity in all corners of the earth, gazing up at the same sky. We, like me, as I sat high above the sand, are not alone. The stars won't stop twinkling and people won't stop dying. These gleaming, these gleaming balls of light oversee our whole world crying. The lapping sounds of the ocean and the noisy streetcars surrounding me were suddenly silenced. <clears throat> I had never seen this amount of luminescence above a city overrun with light bulbs. There were thousands and it was breathtaking. The wind, once bitter, turned, turned comforting and warm. Moments passed and I felt those magical orbs whisper in my ear. So I listened. My eyelids softly closed and then reopened wide. Each flicker grew huge and oh so grand out in our mysterious galaxy. And I thought to myself, wow, they feel just like me. <laughs>